Hi, welcome all of you on your PDI education and you are watching the regular series of opportunities in higher education abroad in the field of engineering as of now and uh, this week I am showing you multiple opportunities in mechanical engineering especially thermal fluid domain in which maximum students go for higher education and they have interest in that. Uh, this week also I am focusing more on direct PhD opportunities. Uh, you know what is direct PhD is immediately after BTEC. So is there any advantage of direct PhD in US? Answer is yes. Uh, or for that matter any countries? Answer is yes. <coughs> so the advantage of direct PhD is uh, you get the scholarship with what you get in the uh, PhD something like in India 31,000, 35,000 and MTech scholarship is 12,500. So one advantage of doing direct PhD is I get more scholarship. That means I need not to spend money from my pocket. Number two, <coughs> I can do PhD fast so that I can immediately after uh, my qualification I can get into the job market that is the other advantage number three <coughs> your stay in that country can be long prolonged so you can get visa for more time these are the advantage but you know getting direct PhD is competitive they expect something more from BS or BTEC students compared to MTech so if you are in BTEC they expect your exceptional background academic background your research paper something like that so if you have that then you can apply now this video is related to uh, direct PhD opportunity in uh, USA in Oklahoma State University in the domain of mechanical and aerospace engineering. So that is what they want and there is no last date so you if you fit in this you can apply for this particular course. Now read this carefully. Uh, multiple research positions are there in computational aerodynamics and hypersonic flows uh, that is the domain in which they will take you. Qualification is BS or MS degree in mechanical aerospace, right? Or uh, MS is preferred, as they said, MS is preferred, but exceptional BTEC they can take. Solid understanding of numerical methods, mathematical modeling, fluid dynamics, computational fluid dynamics, CFD should be known, and you should have programming and analytical skills also, right? So if you have that, then I think you can uh, apply in this particular course. So research project on which you are supposed to work, they have also mentioned that, mentioned that computational fluid dynamics, hypersonic flow simulation, boundary layer stability, that is the topics they mention. And assistantship will be given, monthly stipend will be given, full tuition waiver is also given. So you have to mail your CV, GRE and TOEFL score to the professor. So this is where your PDA helps you. GRE, TOEFL ki theory bohat achhe tarikhe se and then CV and cover letter we can prepare and send the professor. Baki requirements aapke paas honi chahiye and then you seek the counseling from your PDA and then we drop mail to professor. Professor will have a technical interview with you or interview related to your research domain where which we can prepare and then you can uh, send your mail to the professor. And I think uh, once he likes your profile, you are going to be shortlisted. So that is good opportunity you can basically avail this opportunity you can go there and if you get selected scholarship will be given to you keep watching multiple options this week related to direct phd related to engineering aerospace and mechanical engineering especially thermal and fluid thank you